All right, so when your boss asks you to do something, typically you do it if you want to keep your job, right? Sure do. Well, an Ogden woman barely sidestepped disaster after a request that she got from her boss raised some red flags. KSL consumer investigator Matt Gebhardt joins us now. And Matt, this woman was about to commit a crime. Yeah, that's absolutely right, Denny. This Utah woman likely counting her lucky stars tonight after walking into the right bank at the right time. Thanks to alert staff, she stopped just this close to unwittingly breaking the law. When a woman in her 20s walked into this Ogden Bank of Utah, she had no idea she was about to commit a crime. She had been duped into being a money mule, laundering funds for some unknown crook. But the transaction did not sit right with branch manager Melissa Burnson, who says she was depositing checks and then immediately pulling out the money. So she pulled the woman into her office and confirmed. The woman thought she had a new job and was sending cash on behalf of her boss to a client. After the end of the conversation, she realized, oh my gosh, I'm caught up in something that is illegal. But I was there to help her and instruct her. That's right. What she was really doing was taking money that other victims had been duped into sending and washing it clean to make it hard for law enforcement to trace. Burson contacted the KSL investigators in hopes of warning others. Be on the lookout. There's specific red flags. According to the Federal Trade Commission, money mule scams take several forms. For example, victims often think they found online romance and are sending money to a lover, or that they won a prize and are sending fees to claim it. Or, like in this case, folks who believe they were doing honest work. There was never a relationship, a prize, or a job, only a scam. Uh, we've seen an uptick. Burnson says her bank trains employees to be on the lookout and to be proactive having that awkward conversation with customers. That you are, unfortunately, a money mule. You know, these unwitting money mules can sometimes find themselves in legal trouble since what they're doing is basically taking stolen funds into their own bank accounts that are in their own names. If you got something you want the KSL investigators to look into, let us know about it. The number 385-707-6153, or you can email me, Matt, at KSL.com. And it's forced these banks to become more and more alert and savvy to this kind of stuff. The customer service has gone beyond, you know, yeah, here's your interest rate, and it's really making sure that they can, you know, good, good thing she walked into that bank and she yeah. caught an alert teller yeah. and was able to shut this one down. They don't want to catch it, do they? Not always. All right. Good stuff. Thanks, Matt.